Assalamualaikum and salam sejahtera to all. In this video presentation, I would like to talk about our group project assignment for principle of structure which is paper brief assignment. My group member is me, Wanu Hornisa Binti Ibrahim, Chai Yi Ting, Fo Jia Ying, Chen Yi Wai Kazi and Sam Yu Hong. Firstly, introduction to this assignment is develop our understanding of principle of structure by studying the tensile, comprehensive strength and force distribution in a truss. Second, analyze connection, arrangement and orientation of member. Third is understanding how the design of the terrace can affect the distribution of force. And lastly is design and construct a terrace bridge which can stand a mineral water bottle weight 1.5 liters using paper bridge. So much around the doctor and friends, uh, the truss bridge is actually a low barrier structure which encompasses a truss in a simple and high efficient ways. The mixture of the compression and tensions ensure that the structure of the bridge is uphold and the detecting area remains uncompromised, albeit in a strong means. A single span truss bridge is similar to a simply supported beam as it supports the vertical loads by mending. When the truss bridge bends, the top shorts are subjected to the compression while the bottom shorts of the bridge are subjected to the tensions. The vertical and diagonal members undergo either tension or compression. It depends on the orientations. Our group has chosen water design because it's the most common design for both real and model bridge. It's most easily identified by its use of equal triangles. Because besides, we can save up the cost of materials because there is less material required for the construction of our truss bridge. Align the forming of square, which four parts need to be joined. Uh, a triangle in water truss only requires three parts. Next, the equilateral triangles can spread out the loads uniformly across a number of different members when the structure undergoes a disparate loads. The triangles are rich, which contributes to the strength of the structure. When the straining forces apply to the bridge, the design of the warren truss should ensure that there's no bending occur to the tie. Struts and beam of the bridge. In details, the triangles will absorb the compression and tension and then transmit from one side to other sides. To conclude, warren truss design is recommended for long span structure where an evenly distributed load is to be supported and simple structure is required. We have spent a total cost of 10 ringgit in the construction of paper bridge due to the insufficient experience in making the structural works. We spent extra money on A4 papers and superglues which amounted 19 units and 2 units respectively. After the conducting the first experiment, we learned that the sturdiness of the materials used for the construction bridge will influence the seismic stability of the bridge too. The thinness and hardness of A3 paper is greater than A4 paper. Therefore, the paper drafts are strong enough to withstand the, and bear the force exited from the loads. This is our group final paper bridge model. Uh, the model was 380 mm in length and 16 mm in width. Two rows of trusses with five of V-set trusses each were connected to each other by attaching five rows of half A4 papers above the lower chart of the bridge and it was placed at the middle of a warren truss. After the first experiment, we noticed that the structural strength of the model was not fair enough. Therefore, uh, additional 60 mm length of cylindrical paper truss were fixed horizontally at the midst of the V-shaped warren trusses and between two lower cards of the bridge. Furthermore, the truffle of A4, half A4 papers were attached horizontally at the top of the charts of the bridge with 25 mm from each other by using super glue for bearing the pressure as well from the 1.5 liter water bottle and transmitting the force evenly throughout the entire bridge structures. Now we move to structure analysis, testing process 1. We have weakness and also the strength. The first witness is 5 ruler half A4, paper did not function well as member of space to support the wall structure. Second witness, member of brick do not connect and attach to each other well. Some connections are not glued properly. Next, for third witness, V-shaped warrant terrace are not straight. Hard to make sure terrace are straight and all are folded in the same size due to paper are soft. For witness 4, the meter of member are slightly Different, hard to achieve similar diameter of all ruled paper because we rule by hand. For the stretch part 1, we said warren terrace are stable and not easily detached. Position of terrace are fixed and can provide support to withstand load. And the stretch second, uh, 12 ruled paper on the top course are strong enough to retrieve load. More number of roulette paper distribute lot more evenly and each only withstand little lot. Bridge become more resistant to bending force and not easily collapse with load is applied. The purpose of the testing process too is to test and observe the stability of the paper bridge after the improvement. Based on the observation for the testing process too, the paper bridge is stable and able to withstand the load of 1.5 liter mineral water after the improvement of designs. The paper bridge is put between two chairs and the 1.5 liter of water bottle is put slowly and horizontally on the bridge. As a result, the paper bridge is able to withstand the load of the mineral water and the paper bridge does not fall and collapse. 
Pertaining to the observation for testing process 1, we have found that the paper bridge is unstable and unable to withstand the load of 1.5 mineral water. This is because the base of the paper bridge is not strong enough. Therefore, we have improved the design by adding 4 rows of paper with the length of 16 mm between two lower curves. This is important to provide support for the base of the paper bridge. Since the sum of the members of our trusses of the bridge did not connect and attach to others well, thus additional support glue was applied to it in between the members or trusses were whole until the glue were dry. Other than that, we had done some adjustments to make the trusses look straight and nice. This is important because the truss needs uh, serve to support the bridge and build the loads which was exited on the bridge. Apart from it, the sturdiness of the material used for the construction of bridge would influence its seismic stability too. We had changed the material used from A4 paper to A3 because thinness of and hardness of A3 paper is greater than A4 paper.